Now, a question I get asked more than any other is, Richard, should I apply for finance or management? Both are fantastic courses. So for me, this is a strategic decision over being a career decision. Let me explain why. Finance courses at top universities have half the acceptance rate of management courses. That means that just by switching to management, potentially with a finance focus, more on that later, you will double the chances of getting in. Somewhere like LSE's finance course often has as low as 7% acceptance rate, whereas their global master in management is all the way up to 25, sometimes 33%. Now ask yourself, would you rather have a top brand like LSE than not have LSE? If you really want that brand, management is going to double, maybe even triple or quadruple your chances of getting it. Let's put it another way. The academic versus work experience matrix. Now, if you've got a first class or perfect A-levels and great work experience and internships, you fall in the high academic and high work experience quadrant, you can apply to any course of your choice. If you've got lower than expected grades or minimum requirements and no work experience, you should be looking at management because finance will not look at you unless you have some exceptional extracurricular, typically that you have some link to a bank or an offer already made. So what about the others? Now, if you've got a high first class or very, very strong A levels for undergraduate and no work experience, you have a shot at finance, but are far more suitable for management. Similarly, if you've got really, really, really good work experience and have just on the boundary of the grade requirements, you can take a punt at finance, but it is very difficult to get in. Now, why is this so important? Because management is still a brilliant route into finance. It is the second most common degree, and if you've got twice the chance of getting into a top university for a management course, you are more likely to get in than going to a low ranked or not getting any offers for finance. Now, two courses of particular interest I like here, Imperial and UCL's management courses, both have finance specialisms meaning that you can put on your CV that you've got a management degree with a finance major. As you go higher up your career, you will find that management is more useful. Now, management includes finance and economics and accounting, but also human resources, organizational behavior and structure, data analytics, negotiation, leadership, and you can specialize in things like corporate social responsibility or energy management or whatever it is that you're interested in. This is more akin to a mini MBA and can help candidates to thrive through their corporate political journey. Finance is a brilliant quantitative course that is respected and will open almost any doors professionally, but because you're spending your time calculating how to do mortgage annuities and options derivative pricing, you are more specialist. So if you have work experience in finance and know that that's the career for you, have good grades, have good work experience, finance is brilliant. But for everyone else, I strongly consider looking at management. You'll increase the chances of getting into a top university. You'll have a wider set of skills, which will help you to progress through the course. And also management just has much higher student satisfaction because it teaches you wider, broader, and some would say more interesting concepts. So I hope that's a little insight into management versus finance. And if you've got any questions for us, please do put them in the comments below. We love to help getting back to individual students. Good luck.